Hi guys, I'm Maddie and I'm going to do a video about Animal Crossing. Animal Crossing has been a big part of my life since about one and a half week. But before that I also had new leaf, so that was also a big part of my life. Including about seven hours gameplay in one day. The characters are all, or most of them, so cute. And I thought it would be really cool to make an outfit video about this. There are about 200 characters, I think. Maybe I'm wrong, but that's a lot. So I had to make a decision which ones I wanted to do. So I chose for a few that I have in my own town so that I know them better. I also chose for a few other characters that I don't know yet. I am going to look at their feather and fur color. Is that racist? <laughs> And I am going to look at their eye color and not just the clothing. Maybe that's enough talking for today, so let's just get started. I had to tighten the sweater of the first outfit in the back because I prefer to have a crop top instead of this long sweater style, even though it still kind of fits Molly's vibe. I think a crop top or maybe a crop sweater is much more aesthetically pleasing and much more pretty and especially for Molly I think it makes it kind of cuter especially with the long dress. Molly doesn't have really anything on her head so I tied my hair back in a low bun because that's kind of her style and I also added a little black ribbon because it kind of defines her style and it really is a fashion piece that she uses a lot. I also filmed a sneak peek on how the characters outfits look outside so please keep watching till the end of the video to see that. For Raymond, I wanted really to have this business-like style. I don't have a waistcoat, so I compensated that with this blazer, which also looks really fancy. I imitated the hair he has on his head with this white beret. He is also wearing glasses, but I don't have black glasses, I only have these. So they are not mine, by the way, I just found them in my house. <laughs> but here is the final look. This is gonna be explained really shortly because there is not much to say about this outfit. It is just a white dress that I topped with one of my sports t-shirts and I also added a scarf to complement Judy's universal color scheme. Judy is probably one of the most popular characters in the whole New Horizons universe. Uh, I unfortunately do not have her. I do have had Molly in New Leaf and I have the next two characters. The next villager is Lucy and I have asked her to come to my island and live with me because she is the freaking most adorable thing in the entire world. I think this outfit really resembles her kind of style and I also did my hair which looks crazily messy but I wanted to get that cute vibe. Last but not least we have Audie. Audie moved to my village by accident but I think it's still meant to be because she is so amazing. She normally wears a dress like this but with pineapples on it but I got a sunflower one and I'm really happy to have one that looks kind of similar to hers. Sometimes she does wear sunflowers so I could actually say that in some cases I have the exact same dress as her except it's a romper. Oli wears sunglasses, so I thought it would be a great fashion item to add to this outfit because it makes her style even cooler. you enjoyed this video please comment down below if there are other characters that you missed so that i can make maybe a second video thank you so much for watching i really like to make these kind of videos so definitely expect more of these in the future <laughs> please let me know what characters i should do next even if it's animal crossing or another game or just some animated characters thank you so much and i hope to see you next time bye bye